Hello, I am Mac, at least for a day, and everything's going to be okay. The new tier reward of the Quicksilver has been unlocked, and so now we get to go check out the new backpack. This is the first time we've ever gotten a new backpack customization, and in fact, this now marks the first time that we can customize every inch of our appearance in No Man's Sky. We've been able to change our armor and head for a long time, and we recently got the new jetpack trails, but this is the first time we've ever been able to change our backpack. We've had the same backpack forever. So now, we finally get a new one. So let's go buy it and try it on. Oh cool, and we're, we're working on unlocking the next things already. It's more plants. So, cold planet things. That'll be cool. And exosuit backpack. It costs 3,500 quicksilver, but I think it's worth it since it's a pretty unique uh, item. An exclusive exosuit appearance override. A tough modular backpack unit. It's stylized... Its styling calls to mind a previous era of exploration. Transform the appearance of your exosuit and appearance modifier. So let's buy it. We'll go try it on. I'm excited. <laughs> I wonder why it said it. it's like a callback to an older age. M maybe the backpack used to look like that. I think it might have. I think there used to be, like when No Man's Sky first came out, I think... So I'm currently on Backpack Style 1. There we go. Yeah, I think... I think when No Man's Sky first came out, this was the appearance... Like, there was an image of it. I don't think it looked exactly like this, but there was an image of your backpack on the menu, it kind of gave you an idea of what it looked like. Uh, since then they had changed it. Let's experiment with the color a little bit. I don't really see the purple at all. Huh. Let's try different markings. Not a whole lot of difference. Maybe some slight details. I think I'll make it all purple because I can't really tell, at least in this light, that it is purple. Let's try that out. I like that your little, I don't know, droid eye thing on it is a different shape now. That's pretty cool. Oh man, this is really neat. So yeah, now we can change every aspect of our character. And this is our first time getting a new backpack. Nice, I really like it. It's cool finally having a different backpack. I was getting pretty bored of the old, old one. Neat. So, anyway, You've probably noticed that I haven't been uploading many No Man's Sky videos. I'm kind of taking a break from No Man's Sky. I'm just coming on to cover the new Quicksilver items. Uh, like I've said before, the Exomech update didn't excite me too much. I did a few videos on it, but there just wasn't enough for me to do much else with it. So I'm taking a break and uh, Sean Murray in Hello Games uh, put out a new um, development update on their blog recently or on their website that said that they are working on more stuff for 2020, that they've got more stuff planned in 2020. They didn't 
promise that it's going to be out this summer and I kind of suspect that because of what's going on in the world and the fact that Hello Games has to work from home and all that the, the next No Man's Sky update is probably going to be after the summer or very late summer um because they haven't said that it's going to be out by the summer this year but we do know that their new game Last Campfire is coming out this summer so that's something to look forward to I'm planning to do a series on The Last Campfire and then of course I'll do a, some more No Man's Sky coverage whenever we get another big update but that might not be until the fall but we'll see we'll wait and see what happens um, but I'll keep covering any new Quicksilver items that unlock, um, like I have been. So anyway, this has been the new backpack. For the first time, we can customize our backpack in No Man's Sky. So, I have been Mac. Thank you for joining me for a day. And remember, everything's going to be okay.